What up, Melvin7 here, and today, marquee matchups are out uh, a little bit late. They did them at 6 o'clock on the Friday. Usually they're done uh, late Tuesday, uh, Thursday night. But anyway, the first one, we've got Juventus versus Milan. You need one Juventus player, one Milan player, and they all have to be Italian. So these players are probably going to be, um, well, a little bit expensive. The Juventus um, and the Milan yeah, yeah, I thought so. That is ridiculous. They're getting price fixed at like 10k. Luckily, I had two in the club, but of course, you need those. Every other Italian probably isn't too much. Uh, you can see I'm using a lot of untradables here, but I hope it's not too much. Oh my god, the 700... Eh, probably not, right? The rest of the team you could probably get for under about... For about 8k, give or take. You do need some rares, but uh, the the... Milan and the Juventus play you're just gonna have to snipe so uh, you can see what I've used here I'll just quickly go through them um, yeah I mean they're just standard most of them are first owner well it looks as all of them are first owner so that's good for me I haven't paid a penny for that but that would probably cost you because of the price of the Milan and the Juventus player you're looking at 25k maybe so um, that's kind of what the pack is anyway so that's a bit annoying. Maybe wait until they go down a little bit. Right, I dread to think what gold championship players are going for. Probably a lot. Yeah, this. Yeah. Yeah, they're going... Uh, that'll probably be bought. Yeah, I thought so. Like, ugh. I don't know how many golds you need specifically, but of course you only need one Newcastle or Sheffield Wednesday player, so you don't even need, like, more than one of each. Um, Actually, what I'm going to do since I've got... An untradeable TOD here. Might as well stick him in and uh, get rid of one of the gold centre mids, make some money back. Because for me, he's untradeable. The Newcastle players probably aren't going to be too expensive because there is a lot of them. Like, I guarantee this house and guy is probably going for a bit. Um, oh, maybe not as much as I thought. I'll, I'll list them anyway. But yeah, I think it'll be the centre backs. This left back probably will be going for a fuck ton uh, because full backs. Wow. Okay, maybe maybe not. Maybe it's just the centre back, some positions. But uh, yeah, I'll quickly show you the team that I have submitted, just in case you're wondering. But it's very very easy. You need a 74 rated team, so you could just use all silvers. To be honest, you don't really need golds. But I've just got that there to boost up the rating, of course. And uh, yeah, we'll submit that for a premium gold pack. So that's a seven and a half k pack right there. This one, I've tried to be clever with this one. You need one Trappen Spore player, one Fenerbahce player, and seven Turkish players. So, the Turkish players in the Turkish league are going for an extortionate amount. I've got some in my club that, yeah, I've, I've had to use this guy. Like, he's probably 3k at the minute, I would hazard a guess at. Um, yeah, it looks as I'm bang on there. Uh, well... Yeah, you could probably snipe him for about 3 to 4k. So, yeah, the Turkish players are ridiculous. So, what I've done, I've got a lot of Turkish Bundesliga players. You can see Chalanongu, uh, first owner, but I'm, well, he's untradeable. I can't really check. But he was coming up at the same price as Sahin, 950 coins for him. Got this guy for 550. This centre back, people have started to cotton on that you, you might be able to do this for a bit cheaper by using this. So, this centre back was 1,500. Which still isn't that bad, but uh, yeah, he's still roughly around that. Yeah, he's roughly around that. So just try and like do what I've done and hybridize a little bit, so you've got other leagues in there. So yeah, we've got Ginter, Hubner, who are obviously 400 coins because they're Bundesliga German players. There's an abundance of them, but um, yeah, I've tried to minimize the amount of Turkish Turkish league players I've got. That's the Trap and Sport player I've got. And uh, obviously you do need a Fenerbahce one as well, who I have the left back, who I dread to think what his price is. Um, well, it's 3 to 4k, so I mean, it's hard to give a value for marquee matchups because the prices fluctuate so much. But if I was to trade that team in for a jumbo gold pack, it's probably not worth it. You do get a prime players pack for completing the entire set though, so... It, it just depends whether you think it's worth it. You're probably going to be spending 15k on that team as well. So uh, it, it depends if you've done the other three and you really want that prime gold players pack. But this is what I've traded in. This is 2k. Like it's, it's just not going to cost you more than 2k. I've used random players in my club. I've got a 48 rated player there uh, who I probably bought ages ago for loads. Um, 
No, maybe not actually, I packed him, but yeah, you only need one Plymouth Argyle or Wickham player, so uh, this was the player that I've got, and I highly doubt these are even going for too much, because there's so many of them. Oh, wow, okay. Okay, maybe the Plymouth players are going for a little bit, so I'll have a clear out in my club, uh, see how many I've got. It, uh, no, it's not actually that much. It, the Plymouth or the uh, other team, whatever it was, yeah, probably about a thousand for that, so the rest of the team is going to cost you no more than 3k in total so yeah that that's that's worth it you do get a silver players pack which is an 8.5k pack and for completing the set of course we get a prime gold players pack which is a 45k pack so we'll open that i think this week pack value is probably 85 to 90 thousand like this jumbo gold pack are usually trash because there's only three rares like yeah the Oh, I got a rare player. Wow. Okay, I got Sigurdsson. That's actually a lot better than I was expecting. Because, uh, yeah, the chances of getting a, a rare player in these are, are pretty sad. I got two rare players. Wow. Uh, they aren't really relevant for uh, SPC, so we're just going to discard those. Then we've got a 7.5k pack. Um, another rare is uh, Van Anholt. Yeah, Van Anholt. Not too bad, he's decent, uh, probably doesn't sell for a great deal. I've obviously submitted him in an SBC, or else I would have had him in my club. And now we'll open the silver players pack first. Uh, I might get some things that are worth a lot that I just don't know are worth a lot. That guy might be worth a lot if he's uh, League 1. I don't know if he is, he might be League 2. Oh, he's League 1. Oh, Bastia, they were an expensive team when I did. Of course... Of course he's not as much as I thought. This guy though for Monaco, ah, it's Monaco, I don't know, is he? Well, he seems a, yeah he's a decent, decent amount, 3k? Yeah around 3k right, we'll list him for the Lacazette SBC. And uh, what else do we have here, just quickly, Kalsuwe, League 1 again, but it's a goalkeeper, don't know, nah not really a lot, but we'll, we'll list him and I'll just store everything in my club. There's an MLS player there as well, but surely the Giovinco one isn't that expensive anymore. What? 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 Okay, maybe I was a bit wrong. <laughs> yeah, we definitely made more than 3.5k back from just that pack. Um, sorry, 8.5k, which is what the pack would have been worth, right? 25k pack, that opened so quick, so there's no walkout, which is a bit disappointing. We get... Uh, Schneider is probably not going for a huge deal. Um, if he'd have been Turkish in that league, he would have. Uh, do we have anything? Doesn't look as though there's anything that's useful in these SBCs. No, not really. We'll just discard that and move on to the 45k pack. Is it going to be nice? No walkout. I hate these packs personally. I really despise them. They have never gave me anything good. Ever. A 45k pack. Like I've opened loads because of these um, SBCs and they just just a trash utter trash i don't know if you've ever got anything in a 45k pack but personally i think they're definitely not worth 45k i can tell you that for nothing but um yeah one of the players sold there but hopefully i've enjoyed subscribe if you haven't already like the video and yeah peace